Good evening everybody, Extreme Heat Pete here. Tonight I'm doing part one of a four part source review from none other than Scott Rivers, who I purchased four prototype sources. Now tonight we're going to be reviewing the first of the four, which is going to be the fruity, fruity one, which is the milder one of the lots. Give it a good shake. And he's knocking down a bit. Solidified at the top, so I'll do that moment to poke it down a bit. Wow, it smells really nice. Well, I'm doing a mild sauce tonight due to doing the uh, Chili Mark Burns. Fusion 1 challenge last night where I completed two tubes with a 10 minute burn which was pretty amazing, it was an amazing challenge so tonight I'm just doing a mild sauce for you all really coming This is a really, really, a really, really thick sauce. Now, I'm not a huge fan of really thick sauces, but there we go. This is the fruit one. It's got great colour to it. I had a list of ingredients, but I seem to have lost them. So I'm going to go by what I'm tasting on my tongue. There we go. Nice colour to it, nice and thick. Okay, wow. That's fruity. It's got a nice kick. I do believe it's habaneros in this one. I'm tasting the... Um, I'm going to see if I can find his message on my, on my telephone. I'm going to see if we can... Uh, Find the list of ingredients. Sorry about this, people. Should have prepared more. Anyone got any questions while I'm searching? Cheers, buddy. Just walked in. Evening, everybody. Hey, Nukes. Hey, Kaylee. Hey, Stu. How are you doing? Uh, just going to try and find the list of ingredients in this sauce. Stupid phone wasn't meant to be. <laughs> Uh, right, uh, Scott Rivers. So many bloody contacts on there. Unbelievable. Uh, Scott Rivers, there we go. Right, so fir the first one was the fruity, so. Okay, so the Alright, so it's got Arch, Ar Limor, Herbery, Naga and Bonnet, Onion, Preserved Lemon, Flat Peach, Cherry, Tomato, Salad, Tomato, Orange Zest, Juice of Lemon, Apple Cider Vinegar, Cinnamon, Cumin, Sumac, Turmeric and Gin. There we go. Cheers, Kev. I'm not silly as your hat. But hey, that's, you know, I do believe this is the fruity one I've just read out. The Arge, Hurtberry, Naga, Scotch Bonnet, Onion, Preserve, Lemon, Flat, Peach, Cherry. Scott, if you're watching, please correct me. Was it one, two, three or four? Because I'm not, I'm sure. It's definitely not number one because that's the chocolate. Two is the super hot. So yeah, it must be. Must be, must be number four. That's a great tasting sauce. So great, I'm going to go back for a little bit more. Not got a great deal of heat, which is good. So this will be really good with uh, an ice cream or something. Really, really good with ice cream, actually. Yeah, it's, it's definitely, definitely the one with gin. I can smell the, smell the gin coming through. It's quite... 
yeah, it's tickling. And as always, it's another sauce which is not overpowering with vinegar. As everybody knows, I hate vinegary sauces. They're the worst thing in the world. I like my sauces to be full flavour and I know what I'm tasting in the sauce instead of a throat full of vinegar. But that is one tasty sauce for a fruity sauce. Uh, we've still got the the hot will be tomorrow. I'll be reviewing the hot one tomorrow. Roughly about the same time. And then we've got a triple X hot one, which I'll be reviewing on Thursday. And then Friday, we'll be reviewing the chocolate one. The chocolate one smells quite interesting. So I'm looking forward to reviewing them. I did purchase them from Scott for £20 for the four. I believe he's got limited quantities available at the moment. So if you message Scott, I'm sure Scott will be able to sort you out with a, a bottle or two. Great prices as well, £5 a bottle or four for 20 quid, including postage, which is a bargain. But that has been my review of the fruity sauce from Scott Rivers, up and coming producer, I hope. I'm looking forward to tasting more of his products in future videos. But for now, I've been Extreme Hit Peak. I've been a Nukes Chili Warrior. I'm going to go and enjoy the rest of my evening and think about what I'm going to be doing in Sunday's show. I've got an idea of what I'm going to do, but who knows. But anyway, thanks for all for watching. I'll see you again soon. Bye.